Tonight, Southern New England is remembering Senator Ted Kennedy, who passed away late last night. Today, we caught up with a Newport man who had a unique perspective on the senator's private life. Eyewitness News reporter Neka Nuosu joins us live now with local coverage. Karen Hugh Walkenclaus is related to Senator Kennedy through marriage, and today he reflected on the Teddy he knew. Happy, funny, and most of all, patriotic. And, uh, Hugh Auchincloss first met Edward so Kennedy when his stepsister Jacqueline was engaged to then-Congressman and future President John F. Kennedy. Back then, the Lion of the Senate was simply called Teddy. Uh, he was too young for me to admire at the time. I liked him. He was very jovial. He loved to dance. Auchincloss's children are pictured here with President Kennedy around the same time his younger brother Ted joined the Senate and would later become the third longest-serving senator in U.S. history. He loved his country. He had the courage and dignity to admit his, his mistakes, his failings, and um, he was able to rise above it. Kennedy died early this morning after 15 months fighting brain cancer. Auchincloss says he knew it was coming, but things got worse, he says, after the death of Kennedy's sister, Eunice, two weeks ago. His will to live um, wasn't as, as strong. At least he's, he's, he's with his family now. Now, Auchincloss says the last time he saw the senator was about a year and a half ago, right before he was diagnosed with brain cancer. Live with the Mobile Newsroom, I'm Neka Nwosu, Eyewitness News.